Welcome back to Graphic Island tutorial. Today we'll find logo design idea. This morning I got an order for logo design for the association horse riding. In this video I'll show you how to incorporate image to your logo and make your logo more attractive. So let's begin with the page setup. Go to file, new, and here give your page resolution and create. So once you are done with page setup, now go to file, open, and open the appropriate image for your logo. So here we are going to make a logo for horse association. So that's why I found this image would be most appropriate. So let me select this and open it. Once I open this, now what I'll do, I'll select this image and I'll do image trace. So here after doing image trace, you'll see uh, the logo becomes like this. Now we need to expand it. After expanding, you need to go, go to object and ungroup it. After ungrouping, you can see this image is separated. Now I'll drag it and take to our artboard. Now I'll delete this tab. So here we are done with image tracing. Now we'll make a shape for the logo. So go to toolbar and take this pen tool. And from here, we'll make a shield shape here. So from here to here, I'll make it like this. After closing this shape, now select this one, go to toolbar and select this reflect tool. Now by pressing Alt key, drag this center point here and leap to this anchor point. Here give vertical and copy. Now select both and from here unite it. After uniting, let me drag it little bit down so this seems this is not a perfect shape what i was looking for so i'll take this direct selection tool i'll select this anchor point and i'll make it like this and i'll make a straight line at the center and I'll cut it. So I'll take the shape builder tool by uh, pressing and holding Alt key. I'll delete this. And again, I'll reflect it so that we can get a proper shape. So click on reflect tool, drag this point by pressing Alt key and leave it here. Select vertical, copy. Now this one looks perfect, shield shape, and I'll unite it. Now I'll select this one I'll go to Object, Path, Offset Path. Here I'll give negative offset. So I'll give negative 20 and let's see how much it comes inside. This much is coming, yeah. This is the perfect. And I'll change the color for this new shield uh, which is formed inside. I'll make uh, one more shield uh, to the inside. So I'll select this green shield, go to Object, Path, Offset Path. This time, I'll make this new shield little uh, less distance. So I'll give minus 10. This is perfect. Okay, and I'll change the color for this inner new shield. Now I'll select them. I'll take the shape builder tool. I'll delete this one by pressing Alt key. And now I'll take this text tool and here I'll write the text. So here uh, we'll write the company name G N K I. And G E R. And I'll drag it and make the size bigger and take it at the center. 
I'll drag this one by using Alt key and I'll make one more duplicate and drag it down by pressing Shift and Alt key so that from the center it will uh, become smaller and I'll edit this new text E Q now what I'll do I'll change the font for this text because this text will not perfectly match up with this shape so we need to find a proper text for the logo so here we'll select this font contracts sb regular you can download this one and i'll bring it little down and i'll select this one and i'll uh, drag it more down and make the size smaller and take it here so here i'll change the font for this one also so here i'll take this space age uh, font and i'll take it here i'll make it more smaller and i'll take this image here and drag it and make the size smaller now what i'll do i'll select them and, and i i'll align horizontally center i'll take this one down so this foot should be match up with this i'll select the text and uh, go to object expand it after expanding this text will no longer in uh, font format it will convert into object like the shape so i'll select this one and this one i'll take the shape builder tool by using alt key i'll delete this portion so it will match with the k now what i'll do i'll take this rectangular tool and i'll draw a rectangle here from here to here and here and now i'll align this one again horizontally center and i'll select this one i'll remove the fill color give outline color only and i'll give some stroke now i'll select this one and go to object expand it after expanding it convert into an object so now i'll select this one and this one so this area i'll delete it so i'll take the shape builder tool and i'll delete this one this one and here also i'll delete and i'll take this one little down now let me change the color so here uh, we'll do some correction here i'll take this one out and i'll match up with this one like this then i'll select this one by pressing shift key i'll take the shape builder tool using alt key i'll delete this portion i'll take rectangular tool and here draw a background send this one to back let me change the color instead of black let me select this one and let's change the color for this so i'll select this one this one even this one and change the color to white this one again red and this one make it full black I'll select this background object and lock it. I'll select this. I'll take shape builder tool because I want to make 
from here to here it should be completely red in color now logo is prepared hope you like this tutorial you can do support graphic island by doing like share and subscribe thank you